the Holy Bible will become almost impossible to find. Wednesday, January 28, 2015 at 5 p.m. My dearly beloved daughter, I have been cast into the wilderness and feel wretched in my grief at the way in which Christianity is being vilified in the world. My voice is but just a whisper amidst the roar of the beast and those who despise me. These voices of discontent will multiply and drown out the word, which came from my life. Heretics, pagans, false visionaries and prophets, traitors and lovers of molten gold will rise in unison to rebel against me. Those who follow in my footsteps will be downtrodden and laden with the weight of my cross and will have to climb a steep mountain if they are to hold dear all that they were taught by me. The Holy Bible will become almost impossible to find before it will become extinct. Every attempt to deny God will be made until the Word is replaced by the doctrine of darkness. Those of you who believe in me, your Jesus, must never succumb to anything which does not come from me. Only I safeguard you against harm and it is only through me that you will find eternal salvation. Be careful of false prayers you may be presented with for they will not be inspired by the Holy Spirit and are to be avoided. A small word, a little phrase or simple omission, here and there, can turn a prayer into a falsity. Evil is a silent killer of the Spirit and is not easy to identify when it is disguised as being the truth. It is time to weed out your garden and remain true to all that I taught you for anything else is irrelevant and can cause you to lose your faith. Faith in me and trust in my promise to come again, in great glory, must never be shoved aside in favor of the titillation of false prophets, sorcerers, pagans and heretics. My enemies are working hard to deceive you and most of them are perfectly aware as to who I am but they want you to reject me, whatever the cost. You must remain as a small and trusting child when you call on me and I will lead you along the way to my kingdom. I will protect all of you who trust completely in my love and my holy will. Only then can I intervene to wipe away my enemies and spread the truth so that the new world to come can be inhabited by every child of God. Trust, faith, hope and love are important if you are to find the strength to remain by my side. Love for me, without condition, will gain you great graces along your journey to my glorious kingdom, the world which will have no end. Your beloved Jesus.